biophysics, it's well known there is a strong link between size and size changes and a range of essential biochemical parameters. Binding interactions such as KD measurements, size of complex, for example involving multiple binding, immunogenicity, aggregation and so on. With the feeder technology it's possible to measure absolute size and size changes and thereby obtain important new insights and gain a high degree of reliability in your data. What makes our platform unique is that you can measure in solution size and size changes in the range between 0.5 and 1000 nanometers. So that means that you can measure the size of small molecules, RNA, DNA, proteins, peptides, nanoparticles such as for example liposomes, exosomes and even virus particles. In our assay we only need a few microliters of sample and in some cases as little as 40 nanoliters. We can measure directly in solution even in complex media such as plasma, serum and fermentation media. I have worked with biopharmaceutical research for more than 20 years using all available technologies. About 10 years ago, I realized with a colleague Jesper Østergaard from the University of Copenhagen that the immobilization-based procedures often fell short and gave inaccurate results. Because of its ability to measure in solution, we had a good eye to the Taylor dispersion analysis. However, we also realized that a lot of technical improvement has to be made in order to come up with a suitable system. We found out that if we combine traditional trailer dispersion analysis with ligand binding principle, we could have the best of both worlds. The feeder principle is based on a pressure-driven flow in a microfluidic channel. The shape of the signal is determined both by the pressure that you apply to the channel but also of the diffusivity of the system you're looking at. Small molecules diffuse fast, large molecules diffuse slow. We extract the diffusivity and convert it to a size. This is how the feeder principle works. We now have a highly versatile platform for measuring size and size changes accurately, providing you a lot of important biochemical parameters. On our website, you can find application notes as well as more details on the feeder principle.